before dipping dive into our python session we have to ensure that we have installed python in our pc properly so if you are using a windows operating system then you have to find out whether you have installed python properly in your operating system i mean in your pc within your operating system or not so for checking that you have to open cmd i mean command prompt or powershell and for checking python you need to type python dash dash version you see that it's telling me python is not recognized as an internal or external command operable program or batch file so that can indicate two things actually first of all we haven't installed python and the second one even if we installed python in our operating system we haven't added the directory of the binary file in our path variable properly so let me assume that we haven't installed python in our operating system properly first of all we need to install python right so for that reason we need to download python installer package for windows operating system because i am showing you from a windows operating system simply we have to go to python.org this is the official website for python and from here we need to go to downloads and we have to download the latest version as of today the latest version is python 3.10.2 for you it might be different but don't worry make sure that you are downloading the latest version of python simply double clicking on this would start the downloading process so after finishing the download we will get this type of installer let me open the file extension name okay dot exe executable file simply double click on this and uh, click on customize installation check all of this click on next check all of this i don't need the debugging symbol and debug binaries right now but if you need you can check on this as well and click on next sorry install but before clicking install check your install location okay for now i'm simply copying the location here and click on install let it finish the installation process first and you can close all the other windows if you want if you get this type of prompt of disabling path length limit simply click on this and yes setup was successful now you can simply close the window now if i open my command prompt again and check the python version you see that it's telling me i have python 3.10.2 exactly that version which i have installed just now okay now here you have already installed python but if you want to see the path variable in your uh, i mean the directory python's binary directory in your environment path variable then you can do that by simply going to system sorry advanced system settings click on this and from the advanced tab go to environment variables click path click on edit you see that the directory has been added successfully if i open my notepad we see that we have installed python under c program files and python 310 c program files python 310 scripts and python 310 so that means our path variable is also accurate okay that's how you install python in your windows operating system